The death of Patrick Kilonzo Molua has come as a shock not only to his close family, but the world at large. Patrick, known to as many as the Waterman of Savo, or the Elephant Man, came to spotlight in 2016 when he decided to feed elephants and other wildlife with water during the long drought that heated Kenya. I realized that the animals were dying out of that drought and there was nowhere they could get water because of the global warming. Uh, there was no rain for like three years and so it was very serious. So I decided when I came here, I was so much touched to see the animals, they don't have water. So I decided to go back to Voi. I, I had a truck out of my money in the pocket and then I brought water. The first day I brought water, I was so much shocked because many animals were coming running for water. Born in 1973 in Kajira village in Taita, Taveta County, Mwalua grew up in a agriculture neighborhood at the foot of Sagala Hills, addressing human wildlife conflict, which was a problem that affected many families in his neighborhood. Wakati huu tunaona maisha ni magumu sana. Lakini nataka kueleza ya kwamba tukona rasil mali ambazo mungu wa metupatia. In 2013, he indulged in conservation trying to address the human wildlife conflict through the Climate Smart Agriculture projects in his village. In 2016, he surprised the public eye when he chose to feed the wildlife with water when the country was grappling with high drought. His endless efforts to feed the wildlife with clean water has given him global recognition Award ya kwanza. So now and awards including 2018 Head of State Commendation and a Honorary Warden in 2019 for his service to Mother Nature. However, the journey of nobility became a difficult one owing to his deteriorating health due to failure of both of his kidneys. Patrick Kilons was pronounced dead on Tuesday morning of 18th June 2024 after a long illness but fruits of his determination, passion and resilience to Mother Nature will remain alive in the hearts of many. And as from Prime Africa, we say rest in peace. Patrick Kilonzo Mwalua, John Matava, Prem Africa News.